Today, I've got 10 of the fastest players in all of Madden. But by the end of this video, I'm only going to be left with one. The players are going to be competing in rounds of challenges where after every round, two players are going to be eliminated. And round one, what would speed be without a flat out race? So I've split the 10 players into two different races of five players each. And the player that finishes last in both races will be eliminated. And I do want to shout out Chuffsters for this video who did a similar video just like this one for FIFA. Go check it out. It was awesome. And here we go. They're off. Who's going to be getting eliminated in race one of two and it looks like Jalen waddle was just beaten out by lamar jackson and waddle is eliminated and they're off for round two who's going to be moving on and it looks like christian watson this time around is the one being eliminated round two a little bit different i'm putting every player into the wildcat formation and the six players that gain the most yards and move on to round three so many fast players on the dolphins what is this glitch where is tyreek hill going what what is going on? Why is Tyreek Hill lined up inside our fullback? Okay, now we have Tyreek Hill at the right spot. I had to restart the game. Tyreek, one play. Everyone's running the same power play. Tyreek Hill picks up 10. And Tyreek Hill getting us started has set the score to beat. Jamison Williams of the Detroit Lions is up next. Beating 10 yards would be good for him. Everybody's playing the Titans. Everybody's on all pro. And Jamison Williams, one juke, picks up 16. Quez Watkins of the Philadelphia Eagles up next. 16 yards is the top score by Jamison Williams. This looks really good. Quez Watkins, turn on the burners. Couldn't quite go all the way, but 32 yards. That is going to be incredibly tough to beat. Tyree Kill could be getting eliminated. Hollywood Brown, Arizona Cardinals. You want to beat 16 yards. You beat 16 yards at this point. You are guaranteed to move on. Hollywood Brown gets the blocks. Hollywood Brown, another great great score right there for 25 yards and right now after four players have gone we have Tyreek Hill and Jamison Williams in the danger zone Devon Achan this man has been tearing up the NFL the last couple of weeks can he beat his own teammate score Tyreek Hill the blocks no this could be a tackle for loss Achan definitely gonna get eliminated only two yards and oh my goodness look what happened again this glitch why is this a glitch? Tyquan Thornton lined up on the side. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Tyquan Thornton, you beat 10 yards, and you will not be on the verge of elimination. Thornton needs the blocks running into his own teammates. Oh my goodness, you got to be kidding me. And Thornton only gets six yards. And with two players left to go, here is our danger zone. Here we go, New York Jets, Mikol Hardman. Reese Hall's in motion. Can we get some good blocks and not run into the teammates? We're going to lose yardage. Miko Harmon, negative six yards. Okay, Lamar, end us off for the Wildcat Challenge. What are we going to get? Lamar Jackson. Jackson spin move. Lamar Jackson, 18 yards. And after round two, Devon H. Chan and Miko Hardman have been eliminated. Six fast players remaining, and next up is first to score. This is very simple. The four players with the fastest times to score will move on to the next round. So I got Tyreek Hill to get us started here. Now, Tyreek is lined up to the left. Everybody's going to be facing the Seahawks. Hopefully, they're lined up one-on-one -on -one with Tariq Woolen because he's the fastest corner in the game. So I'm getting the stopwatch started. We are going to have Tyreek go first. Tyreek might fly right past Woolen. Woolen might not be able to stop Tyreek Hill. No, we can't. You got to be kidding me. No one's beating that time of eight seconds. What a way to get the round started. And with that unbelievable time from Tyreek, he obviously has the number one spot to get us started. Next up is Jamison Williams. And I'm sending everybody on the first play on Woolen just on a straight up streak. And Williams cooked him, but God, his QB just costed him. Not every play has to be a streak, though. Jamison Williams, catch it in stride and run. He's turning upfield. He almost got an angle right there. We are no huddling to the line of scrimmage. Not every play has to be a streak down the field. It's not working. Switch it up and the in route's working beautifully. Jamison Williams to the 30. Goff, get out of the pocket. Deliver a football. Jamison will... He didn't keep his feet and bounce like click possession catch. Forget this. We're going back to the one-on-one -on -one ball. He's got him this time. Goff. Are you kidding me, Jared Goff? Several days later. Just hit him on a slant. I can't take this anymore. Oh, please get in the end zone. Please, Jamison Williams, put us out of our misery. Jared Goff, 
I don't understand, man. You're good in real life. You're pretty darn good nowadays. And it really took you nine minutes and 22 seconds to get this man in the end zone. Next up is Quez Watkins for the Philadelphia Eagles. Please don't take an eternity here, Quez Watkins. Let's see what you can do. Can you get it done in one play? Jalen Hurts deliver a good football. Quest Watkins, he makes the grab. This should be way quicker than Jamison Williams. Just don't make a mistake now. Just get the ball in Watkins' hands. He's not going to beat Tyreek, but he's definitely going to beat Jamison Williams. Just roll out, Jalen. Deliver a good football. He dropped it. That's on Quez right there. He catch this fourth down. This is crucial. He dropped it again. Quez, just get a PI call. Go deep. And you catch that one. Are you kidding me? He caught that one. Hollywood Brown's up next, and it's time to put people on the bubble. People can start to get eliminated. Hollywood, what a grab to the 19. So right now, Jamison Williams, because of Jared Goff, is the only guy not to catch the one-on-one -on -one ball to start it off against Woolen. Fucking Hollywood, finish it. Come on, Hollywood. There it is, 21 seconds. Now that's what I'm talking about. And with two players to go, Jamison Williams and Quez Watkins are in the danger zone. Up next for the New England Patriots, we have Tyquan Thornton. Let's see what he can do. Tyquan Thornton. Oh, he's getting double coverage, unfortunately. He's not even going to have a chance. He's not going to have a chance one-on-one -on -one with Tariq Wool, and he drops it. Doesn't look like they want Thornton to get a one-on-one -on -one chance here. Actually, here we go. One-on-one -on -one chance. He can't burn him. Woolen, though, not picking it, at least. Try to get him on a slant. One-on-one -on -one ball's not really working. He's not really getting a great chance here against Woolen. That's a good throw by Mack, and there's a first. To make it to the next round. Thornton over the middle. He's in one minute, 59 seconds. And our last player is Lamar Jackson for this round. And since he's not a wide receiver, I made him a wide receiver and increased his catching stats. Okay, final player here. It's Lamar Jackson. If Lamar beats Woolen... Don't tell me he's going to beat Wool in first play. Oh, I don't know what happened there to Lamar Jackson, but it's incomplete. I gave Lamar a really good deep route running. I gave him good release, good catching. So he should be able to go up and make plays. And you see that speed. I didn't touch anything with his speed. Huntley! He almost hit him. Woolen with a good play. You kind of have to go for it all. This has to be it for Lamar. He's out. He's got a step. Huntley! And Woolen again with a crazy play. Yep, and by the time we get the ball back, two minutes, 41 seconds, Lamar is out. And after this round, we say goodbye to Lamar Jackson and Jamison Williams. Now, the next challenge is NFL tug of war for these four remaining players. Now, for those of you who've watched my tug of war video, each player will be starting at the 50 yard line and each of them will have three plays to go ahead and get the furthest they can into enemy territory. The player that gets the furthest in those three plays moves on to the finals. We get three plays. Tyreek's up first. Tyreek on the slant. He's got it. Oh, he might score. He's gone. Tyreek Hill. One play. See you later in the end zone. And I realized I had the difficulty on rookie for this. So I'm just going to have Hollywood Brown face the CPU on rookie too. All right. Well, Hollywood has to score on this first play or he's out. It's possible though. We are on rookie. Get it to him. Hollywood. Make one man miss or break a tackle and you're gone. Instead, he's gone. Just like that, we say goodbye to Hollywood Brown. Okay, here we go. Tyquan Thornton for the Patriots. Getting us started. Thornton holds on to the ball. Picks up eight. Play number two. Fitted inside, Mac Jones. And he's at the 21. Just pretty good yardage. Just take whatever you can get. Oh, no, I threw a pick. He dropped it. He's at the 21 to finish. Wes Watkins has to beat the 21. He's got three plays. First play is drop. It's already play number three. You might as well go for it all. He might have him. Wes Watkins does it on play number three. He needed 29. He got 50 in the touchdown. And the final touchdown is a 99-yard touchdown. But they're going to be going up against one another. One's going to be playing corner. The other one's a wide receiver. And they're going to switch roles after one scores. So here we go. We got Tyreek versus Quez. Quez is on Tyreek. I didn't change his stats at all. So I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if Tyreek's going to completely fly past this man. Quez actually not terrible coverage. On the first play, and he had safety help over the top. Quez not really on Tyreek right there. Tyreek just kind of went around. Quez Watkins, he mossed, I think, blanket ship right there. And Tyreek Hill, can he win it? 32 seconds is a score to beat for Quez Watkins. All right, for the win, Quez Watkins. 32 seconds you have as a score to beat. He's flying past Tyreek. And Tyreek, what a defensive play. Oh, but Tyreek's pressing him. That's a mistake when you're not a good corner. Quez Watkins, it's a foot race, but Tyreek Hill still has that 99 speed to catch him. Two seconds left. 
Tyreek Hill has won. And Quez Watkins, of course. Is he going to do it? Let's just see. Tyreek Hill, will he catch him? He won't. But Tyreek Hill is the winner. And congratulations to the fastest player in Madden and in the NFL, Tyreek Hill. That's going to do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor. Hit the like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And make sure to go check out my other channels, which are in the description down below. And I'll talk to you on the next one. Peace.